How you doing guys? This is Hybrid Steel. Welcome to another live stream of The Planet Crafter. I'm gonna, I'm still, it's still in my brain. It's still ticking right here. It's, where can I go? What can I do? What fun are we going to find? And it's just, there's lots and lots of exploration that I want to get into. And I want to build stuff and I'm actually excited. Genuinely, I think this is one of those weird games that's just going to be good. Like, the whole time. I don't... If you're into this sort of game, I think this is... It's going to be that sort of... You know what? I actually want to give this one a run. I want to see where I'm going. I want to know what I'm doing. Actually, I do need to build more water. Where did we... Did I build water last time I played this? I can't even remember what I did this morning. And when I did this this morning, it was like, Hey, I'm going to build water. And I didn't build any water. So, water. We need to build lots and lots of water. Because we're going to run out otherwise. Water, water, water. And then what we do is we go for a run, pick up some more ice on the way, pick up some more water, and we'll be all good. Put it in my fridge. And there we go. B -b Bonus. Right, we're just going to put my cobalt up in the cobalt fridge. That's going up there. Uh, yep. That can go in there. I'll put my magnesium in there as well. Fantastic. Awesome. Now, here we go again. So over there is iridium. Over there is aluminium, and over there is a ship that we've already gone through. That's okay. So there are two other places I need to go, really. Um, I need to explore that way a lot more, and I need to explore that way a lot more, and that ship over there. Now, that ship over there is where I want to head to next, and the reason why is because I set up a pod to get over there so I don't have to keep using my oxygen. Yeah, we're being a little bit smarter now. It's all good. It's me actually being smart for once. I'm like, yeah, I'm preempting. What are you doing? I'm going to run to my pod, which is 200, about 200 bits of oxygen away. That's literally how I'm measuring things. How much oxygen does it use? That's where I need to be. So that little pod there is where I'm heading. And then we're going to head to that ship. Mechanic Chance, what is up? How are you doing, sir? So yeah, this is the plan. The plan is... Oh no, and now my kid wakes up. Let me get to the pod, and then I've got to go and deal with my child. I'm nearly there. If it's just him needing to go to the toilet, I'm going to be very disappointed. Right. Back in a second, guys. Let me just turn the mic off, then you don't have to hear it. Right, sorry about that. It's mainly just because I don't think I've set up my music on my BRB screen. So I'm still here. Oh, I have. Ah, okay. Cool. Right. That makes a lot more sense now. I have actually set up. Right, cool. We're going to the ship. The ship. I haven't got any iron or titanium on me, so... Silicon glass. If I can find some... Interesting. Very interesting. Titanium, iron, if we can find one more bit of iron, we'll be alright. Silicon. There we go, bit more iron. 
So this is the big ship. This is that. This is a massive one by the looks of it. Massive, absolutely massive. It got buried though. So the main reason why I made it all the way here is I need to get inside here. This is a big, right. I need titanium and iron. Okay, titanium. Is that iron? Ha! Huh. It's like a message from the space Martians. Ah, and now we can breathe. Right, cool. So we're going in here. Oh my god, look how big this... This is a big ship, man. Right, we'll go left first. Oh, a little bit pointless. Oh no! Oh no, there's lots of stuff! I'm on a different floor! Oh no, this is gonna be too big. Too big, man, too big. Did I bring. I did bring oxygen with me. Yeah, I did. That's alright then. Your bronies, that's a lot of stuff. We are full. Alright, so I've just used the last. Actually, because I've used that, we'll take that. Alright, so. Well, this is going to be a really big. But this is going to be a pain in the ass to go through. Wow, okay, so. We need to do this like systematically, like from one side to another. Right, let's just hop in here. Let's get myself all like healed up. And then we can run. That way. Hey, Teresa, welcome. So we're up to the big ship. I'm, I'm the furthest away from home I've ever been. This map is massive, though. I mean, I'm, I'm, I, it's huge. Get back to my pod, and then we'll uh, we'll sashay back to the uh, thing. I really should do what you said by like building a chest somewhere, and I think I might chuck it all in here, so I can do a couple of runs back and forth, maybe. But on the plus side, what I'd like to do is I'd just like to... Actually, you know what? From that place, like 280, that can get us all the way to the crash, to the ship. It's not bad, not bad. Hmm. Hmm, I stroke my beard on this one. Alright. Okay. I do like how vibrant the sky got, though. Like, 100%, that's blue. We just need some clouds. Going back in time. Boop, doop, doop, doo doo. Doo 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 There's my home. I do want to explore that way a bit more as well. We'll see how things go today. Awesome. Now uh, we got one bit of iron. Put some food in. Oh, I can't put any more food in the fridge. <laughs> Damn it! All right, so we got some. We got some fairly cool stuff this time round. Iridium goes in here. There you go. Right. All right. So, that's sort of what I'm going for next. So, I need a T3 backpack, which is what I'm wearing. I need the super alloy and titanium. So, I need three lots of super alloy. 
funny enough, I have three sets of super alloy. It's amazing. I'm going to take my backpack off. Yeah. If we drop that for now, pick that up, wander over here and get my... Oh, I need titanium. Smeg. I thought I had titanium on me. We'll swap that out for a second. Then we'll build our backpack. Oh, yes. My level four backpack. I've got so much room. Right, next. I think we need the... Oh, wow. Okay, cool. I think we need the oxygen tank. So we need super alloy and cobalt, mainly. And we've only got two lots of super alloy. That's a bit of a shame. Can I make? I can make super alloy, can't I? Right. How do I make super alloy? Cobalt. I need one of everything. I can do that. Yeah, I can. Um, one. I can actually do one of everything. Cause I hoard. Cause I'm a hoarder. Oh my god, that's where I put... Oh, okay. Um, take all this out. Uh, that's uranium. Not uranium. Iridium, sorry. E. Rid. E. Um. There we go. Did you see there is news of this weekend? A big change. What, for this game? Ah, oh, poo. Right, well, I better get ahead of myself then, because if there's going to be a big change, I need to get myself going. Yeah, we needed one of these. Fantastic. Now we've got three. Cool. So now I need to build this. So I need to take my oxygen tank off. Build the fourth. Oh, yeah. No, I didn't read anything. Um... So that's a big shock to me because it's like, I didn't really want anything. I don't want nothing to change, you see, at the moment. Sort of just getting used to this game. And it's like, hey, well, yep, change. What? No, no, no change. Afraid of change. Don't need change. Can't put my food in the fridge. Right, so that's fine. Right, all good. So. This is my quarters. I need. I think I need a window on this bit here. Like a balcony. I really should. I need. I think I need more oxygen. I mean, that's 370 now, so that's doing bloody good. I need cat. Okay, yeah, I need, I need cobalt. We're going to go on a cobalt mine. Cobalt. This way. But no, I did not see anything that was going to change. What's changing? Or did it just say there is a big change on its way? Because that's a bit cryptic. Cryptic metaphor. But what I like about this is that... James Cross, welcome to the chat. Um, what I like about this is... I'm able to play this game quite happily... And I'm not really getting bored. Well, not just yet, you know? And I've done... This is my third live stream of this game. We'll probably rack in another, like, two hours of gameplay today. So I'd have done two, four, about nearly six hours worth. And I've got to be honest, it's not bad. Maybe plans, not sure. Well, I, I know there's supposed to be a prologue coming out. Because this is just the demo. Because the prologue is a separate entity. And it's like, okay, cool. When's the prologue coming out? So that might be the big change. It might be the prologue comes out and we get like a a more update version of this game. Good day to you, Justin. How you doing, mate? So yeah, I'm, uh, I don't know. All I can do is hope that they don't change it. Did you flood? No, not yet. We're only up to 243,000, thou yeah, 243,000 TI, which is transformation value. I don't know what the value actually is. There you go. It hasn't rained yet. Let's put that away. But 
I do have cobalt now, which means I do need to build lots of water, um, uh, oxygen. I'm doing good, matey. So we got all this. And then the rest of my cobalt, I'm going to put in the cobalt shit in the fridge. And then I've got water, that's good. I've got oxygen as well, we're all good. And, um, yeah, we've got to go and pick up a load of stuff from the, uh, the ship. <laughs> Demo removed for prologue. Okay, well this just said it... Oh, I've received... I've got the new heater now. Um, okay. Yeah, it is a really, really chilled game. Like... You don't feel like you're rushing. You know, you do things at your own pace. You want to move this? Do that. If you want to do this, go and do it. Be happy. You know, just don't break the game. You'll be fine. But, you know, I think it is just one of those, like, nice games. Oh, nice. As I said as I said the other day, we're like, what's a prologue? Uh, basically, the prologue explains the story. Like, why you're there. That sort of thing. So... I've done a couple of prologue things for the channel where I would show you the start of the game, how it all starts, that sort of thing. That's that's a prologue. We're going to the big ship. Basically, I just want to get... I want to get this ship done, but there's a lot in here. Well, I did a stream today as well. So this morning, for me, well, the kids were at school. I was like, yeah, I was just doing like another hour, maybe two. Yeah, and I stuck, I stuck in another load. So we moved the entire base um, to the top of a hill. And I just carried on. There might be another ship over there as well. Got any iron? So right, we're only going in it. No, this is the big ship. Oh. First things first, got to go down. Right, so there's nothing there. There's a quarters there. We've been. We've done those two boxes. End of this corridor. Done. Fantastic. Right, so we've done this one. Next. but these two cool oh my god iron right so that's this level done Pods. So they were trying to grow here. That's good. Now I've got to make a run back. Okay. Interesting. Oh no, it's multi leveled. Right, okay. So now I've got to run back to me or. What I'm gonna start actually, because I've got I've got a few bits of oxygen on me. What are the glowy thing? Um, give me a sec. Let me just let me build some storage. Glowy thing? I'm gonna assume you mean like all the stuff that's laying around.
need water. I'll leave that there for a second. I've got, you know, I should take it back with me. Right, I uh, will take the whole contents of this one and we'll run back. Right, so what I need to do, I need to come here with a bit more prepared. I need to, yeah. Oh, okay, so basically it's like a, a girder that's in the way. So I destroyed the girder to get past it. Is that, yeah, it's a girder. Need ice. I need as much ice as possible. I need to. I need to build myself some drinks. Thankfully, I've got breathing spots all the way across. But because we've upgraded level four of everything now, I can do the run in one go, so I can get around a bit faster, which is good. That's what I need to do. And when we finish that ship, because that I think that's the last thing this way. I think um, I've got to go through the uh, the like the metal forest. I could go in there, because that's the Iridium Cave. And that's quite big as well. So, yeah, there's lots of fun to have. And at the moment, nothing's really going to ha majorly happen. Uh, this is uh, Harris Heller's Lo-Fi playlist. Should recognise it from the fact it's the same music. I, I literally play the same tunes the whole time. But because I stream for like four hours, you never really hear the same music twice. And those playlists are so long. There's so much music on there. It's unbelievable. This is why I told you the other day. It's like one of the best things to have if you want like lots of choice of music. Chuck it in there. All my CMS videos, I literally select one album and then put like seven tracks into it. And then it's free. because it's free, he gets pay, he gets money anyway. Right, we need to start making um I need to start sorting out my inventory mind you so that would go there that's iron 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 uranium goes up here because this is uranium not ice uranium that is aluminium so that can go in there yes yeah, it's, it's the same stuff man same stuff right now let's make some water we need to make lots of water Bubbly, bubbly, bubbly. Right, whilst I'm here, actually, because I made a load of water, we'll drop this into one of my storage tanks down the other end. That'll be alright. Iron. Let's make another one of these. So, uh, one iron, two lots of ice, magnesium, and silicon. There's magnesium. Silicon, uh, this one. Yeah. Can you make vehicles? Nope. 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 Which sucks. You can't. You can't drive vehicles. Okay. Now we're terraforming faster. And we got level three heaters now, so I can make iridium iridium rods, which I can actually do because I've got this. We need lot. We need nine lots of iridium just to make one rod. Thankfully, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. So we take one of these, make an iridium rod, which is pretty damn cool anyway. And then we need to be silicon, titanium, and aluminium. So, silicon, titanium, and aluminium. 
what we'll do is we'll remove this one and remove this one and then we'll build this one boom oh yeah I mean they should do because well, you never know this is a demo you can download it now One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So yeah, this demo is really, really generous. It's it's right there. You can down, you can get it for free off of uh, Steam. And there was a person in here the other day who was saying that he'd spent like ten hours playing it and it still hadn't died. So that's amazing. Okay, we are out of power. Damn. Right. So I need magnesium, cobalt, and aluminium. Thankfully, cobalt. I think we need magnesium. I don't think I have any magnesium in storage, which sucks. No, I don't have any magnesium. Right. Need to find some magnesium. Very. Oh, there's some. I don't think that was supposed to happen. Let's take some more just in case. Uh, the the planet crafter. Gary Whitfield, welcome. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be honest. Really liking this. Yeah, it's called the Planet Crafter. Title is in the, um, title's in the, in the title. Strangely, we got enough. Right, we're going to go and build another solar panel because I've just broke again. No. Oh. Put the wrong place. There we go. <laughs> More power! There we go. Yeah, I added this to my wish list, so when it comes out eventually, whenever it comes out, I'm ready for it. I, w I probably will pick this up. And I probably will do a little sort of like knock you through playlist thing, because I think from start to finish, you know, you've got enough, there's enough thing in here to make actual content you know tell the wifey we say hello she's just waving don't worry she's alright she's just had a hard couple of days she's had a pick line removed now which is good it means the, sl the process is slowly coming back oh no it's the meteorite storm that means there wasn't enough elements on the floor cool well, there you go. That's how fast. We're, this is how fast we're doing it now. We're ramping it up. <laughs> Iron and cobalt. I just want. I need. I don't know how many I need for making windows, so I'm just going to take as much as I can. That do me. All right, windies. So you know what I could do with like an emergency door here, so I could actually. Oh, I haven't got titanium and silicon. Okay, I need titanium and silicon quick. Uh, one of those, and one of those. There we go. Titanium and silicon. Up we go. I'm gonna build a door so my house has a veranda. There we go. Fantastic, right? Oh no, I need more titanium. There we go, right. Oh, yes. Living the life of luxury in... And it's a nice view as well. It looks good. I want more. I want more titanium. That don't mean... Right, up. Right, and then I need to build one more here, so this whole place opens up. But I need I need more iron for that. Actually, you know what? Oh no! I just destroyed the middle floor. Crap! 
Oh no! Right, now I screwed up. <laughs> there we go, it's back. I don't think there wasn't anything important here, that's fine. <laughs> oh no! Let's not do that again then, shall we? <laughs> yeah, get rid of... You, you can destroy your base quite quickly. <laughs> and there's not a... Are you sure you want to do this? So that should just make my my whole upper house like there we go that's better i want to put a door here though so titanium and silicon is needed okay right that's not what i want to do there we go the fuck I'm not sure what I just did there. That doesn't seem very right to me. Um. Right, okay. I think it broke. Yeah, I don't know. There we go. I'm just going to leave it there because that's caused problems. I need silicon for a door and then we'll be alright. Well, you know, I, I don't know. Um, right, I need some silicon for the last piece, which is to put a door in up here. And there we go. Ah, and that's my bedroom. Yay me! Anyways, so enough dithering about. Right, so we've got on us. We've got elements. So we don't really. Just gonna actually no, I don't need to put it on there. I need to put titanium in there. Yeah, I might have to just do a um a dry run on that in a minute. Hello. Have a have a good evening. Or afternoon, morning, or whatever time of day it is. Okay, so I've got an inventory for, actually, you know what? If we take some food with us, we can stay out for longer. And I'll put it in my pot. I'll put it in my pod, and then we can we can spend a lot more time over here, emptying out this ship, and then we can come back. But and I know it's just like one run for the oxygen, so that's not too bad. It means we can get over there, pick up a load of stuff out the ship, and then go back back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So that's good. That's that's pretty much where I'm going for. It's all right. It's all right. All right, brother. And off we go. I want to. I want to explore this cave soon. It gets dark in there though, but I want to explore it because when I finish this ship, I don't know if there's anything else to do apart from literally just terraform the planet. But what I wanted to do is I wanted to explore everywhere before it starts doing like the actual changing. My Betty Boop, welcome to the stream. I don't recognise the name, so thank you very much for popping by. There 
Oh yeah, right. Straight over till morning. So this ship's multi-layered. Which sucks. Because in order to go all the way to, into the deep end of it, it's like up and down ladders and potentially getting lost. So it's got to try and remember where you've been to get out. Apart from that, it's alright. There's enough bits of ship laying around. And yes, I'm being very careful about how I pronounce that word. <laughs> Jump in here quick. Ah, oh, fresh air. Right. So we'll be alright. We've got enough of everything, we should be fine. Actually, if I leave... this in here then we can spend a bit more time in here right so it's F we've done that level there okay so that, was one, that one's done so now we've got to come down here we've got to go through all of this so we've done oh no yep we did this one as well so we've done the first left Damn science labs. We've done this one. We have now. Right, cool. Right, so there's a ladder that goes up. So we've got some more seeds. I don't like the fact the light is so small, so I'm going to try and find a way. Of, I hope there's a way of upgrading this because this light is a pain. Right. Why do they lock this off and there's nothing here? Interesting. Right. So now it is up the ladder. There's nothing in there. Why do they lock that off then? It's very strange. Okay, so we've gone up the ladder. Right, now there's only this way to go. Someone's got a gaming simulator. Awesome. It's very strange that... Oh, those seeds are going to speed this up so much faster. There's nothing else really in this ship. It's massive. But there's nothing in here. It's very, very odd. I think we're done. So I think we need to heal up. Right, so we need this, this, and this. So if that's it, I've got new blue... i got the launch platform. Okay, cool. Right, we're, we're starting to build, like, proper rocket stuff now. So I think that's where, that's where we need to start focusing. And I think we're done. I genuinely... I don't think there's there's nothing else left in here, unless there's a gold, um, unless there's a gold box on the ship, which there there are gold boxes. I just made all the boxes once I empty them, leave them for the floor. Well, yeah, the, the boxes respawn though, so I sort of didn't see the point in taking them away after them. All the boxes respawned. I was like, ah, oh, right, okay, but that is it. This is the big ship, like, massive. But you can definitely tell that this is, this is going to be a big game by just seeing by just seeing how this is. I think there's a, a gold box on this one though. Well, they haven't quite finishing texturing and finishing this area, have they? 
I don't see it. That's fine. It's definitely a valley. There's nothing else here. Cool, cool. Right. Well, I think we can scoot ourselves back a bit now. You know what, I might actually just leave this here. And the main reason is just in case I have to come back here another time, you know? When this game updates, I don't know what's going to change. I might have to go all the way out that way and I need a drop-off point. This is a good little drop-off point. Smart thinking. Very, very interesting there. Anyway, next the next stage is the Iridium Cave. I want to go in there and just really get into this. Oh, the box. And then, oh no. Right, so that's just off from, okay. That's fine. So what I'll do is from that, I'll, we'll run back to base now, drop off all this stuff, and we'll come back to here. And it, So it's straight down there. Okay, cool. Got it. Let's go. Straight home. And then, I'm going to start building properly. Because we can build the space rocket, we can build the launch pad. We're going to start terraforming properly. Really, like, hammering in. Lots of power needs to be put in, though. So, lots of solar panels. Lots of everything. Or, we might be even able to go to nuclear. To put a nuclear. That'd be cool. Make a reactor and make it go boom. It's a bit warm. Do, 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 do. So we've done everything so far. As I said, I want to go into the back of the Iridium Mines, and I want to go over there a bit more. Cause we've done that ship, we've done that ship. We've been in there as well. There's not a lot in there. I did that ship. Oh, I can do... Biodome! Biodome! Right, we can, we can definitely make big base now. So I got I got room to expand up here, so we're all right. Cool. All right, iron. We have iron. That's okay. We got flowers. So these two, this one and this one, are rarer than these. These are like fifty and a hundred percent. These aren't very good, actually. You know what? Because these are better anyway. We'll take those and those. And we'll switch these out. So, oh, okay. We'll drop that for a second. It's because I've been growing the wrong stuff. Go. So now it's re it's going to start ramping up a lot faster because of the seeds we're now growing. Because these things, they're just green. They don't really do much. These, these are 100% oxygen generation. So that's good for the atmosphere. And then obviously the stuff, the other things up in there, like the golden flowers, like 500%. So that's that one. This one's 500% oxygen bonus. This one's a hundred percent. This one is fifty percent. So yeah, yeah. That was, five thousand nukes was amazing. I mean, it did it didn't work properly, but it was good. It was fun. I enjoyed making it. I, I've got to be honest, though, it was a bit. Even with the mod, it's it was so much work. 
but it, it just wasn't that funny but it was fun at the same time if you know what I mean it makes no sense but yeah right so I'm putting magnesium here at the moment so that's it or where am I put, did I put it in cobalt didn't put it in cobalt I put it in titanium okay so that can go in there cool we're good we're good we've got some food got some water need water Alright, so next, because this is my main base, I'm going to start putting things like this in here and making all this better and bigger and awesomeness. So now we can build the biodome, which is this. So we need, uh, I need to build some super alloy. Because so I think I've got, hang on, ooh, I might have three. No, I've got one. Right. What do I need for a super alloy? It was a fun video. See, that's, these are the things that Daniel Patel was saying. You make things like this, have fun with things, and yeah, yeah, it's all good. So, one of everything. Okay, so I need to make two. So, two of those. Um, do I need ice for this? Do I need ice? Ice? No, I don't need ice. I need two of everything else but ice. Oh well, we're all good. I think that's two of everything, so I should be able to make two of these. I need silicon. Thankfully, I have two. One. Two. Cha ching. Right, next. Now, what do we need? I need. Oh, yeah, no. Hold on. We need this. And then we need two cobalt. Okay. One aluminium. One titanium. Do you have any mining stuff in this game or do you have to do it? You have to do it all manually. Which is part of the joys of the game, I suppose, where you would just. You're basically building to how you want to play the game. You know, I actually don't mind games like this where you, you have to do all the work. Why can't I make this? Perfect place to grow. Oh, it's because I'm not carrying a plant. Uh, uh, that one. There we go. Now we're carrying a plant. Oh, we. Yeah, I think we're going to have to build. Um, yeah. We're going to have to build a pad even out the ground I think that's a good that's a good place to put it right I don't know how big this is, by the way. That might be big enough. I just shut my plant down to make this. Now we haven't got enough power. It's insane. Right. Magnesium silicon. I don't think we've got any silicon left. We're all out. Right. I need to go silicon hunting. Never thought I'd ever say something like that. Let's go silicon hunting. Let's go and find Katie Bryce. That's not silicon. That's silicon. Iron. search there is so it's this sort of triangular rock so the next one is there that's iron 
I've already wished there's this game. Stop telling me. And I think there's another bit. Right, I think we got enough. So I think I have to make the entrance to this biodome thing, but I need to make those. Um, I really need to make another solar panel. Let's get some. We need some proper energy coming in now. Basically, the idea is to run it on bare necessity power at the moment, and then um, go from there. So magnesium. Need some iron. So that's this one. Uh, cobalt and aluminium. Okay. Aluminium and two lots of cobalt. Awesome. Did I get two? Yeah, I did. I got two. It's all right. It's all good. Right. There is a reason why I, I do the stuff the way I do it because my brain doesn't rebel. We haven't got enough power. We need to build another. We need to build another load. I think I've got enough to do one more. So two lots of cobalt. Some iron. Xbox just sent me a message. Yeah, whatever. Right, that's everything. Cool. Let's build another one. So this is solar power farm, this is. My drills are drilling. That means my my biodome is working. Now, I got to design a way of getting in. So I need I I need to build some lights at some point as well. We're running out of stuff. Let's put it that way. Need to build the door. Cool. Ugh. Oh, you got to be joking. That didn't connect. I suppose I just stick a door on the front of that, don't I? Yep. Sort of what I was thinking. Uh, oh, for God's sake, I know exactly why that didn't work. This is beyond fracking stupid of like next level bullshittery. <laughs> it's next level bullshit. You should be able to sink these stairs or join them up. Oh, that's going to have to do. That's so wonky. Oh, yeah. No, I just took the foundation out. Oh, my God. If you reached 150,000, the atmosphere is now blue, but there's still a long way to terraform. If you continue to increase the TI... Water will start to rise on the planet. Well, that's the plan. Yeah, I just took out the foundation whilst I was standing on it. That's just stupid. Now I can't put the foundation back. Screw it. I'm just going to leave. I'm, uh, just don't go near it. It's fine. Alright, so now we're boosted. I mean, we're nearly at half a million now. 
it's cure we're doing all right so i think from now i want to generates energy that powers all machines at the plant i think we need to start building nuclear reactors <laughs> <laughs> right let's get serious now shall we I'm getting hungry <laughs> and thirsty my character's like starring over here are you, are you gonna feed me no it's gonna leave me to die I see how it is you don't like me alright cool right so I think we've unlocked everything interesting well, mine's still going. Maybe. I don't know. I could make up some bullshit about why it's not working for you. But it's it probably just you know, crap on everything. Build it! There we go. Uranium fever got me going low. Right, that's done. Cool. Got lots of seeds. There, we got a biodome going. We are blitzing this. And the water's still not rising, so it should be safe for a little bit longer. Right, I need to make it to that box. There was a box just off from one of my pods. So we'll go to that box now. I thought this was a video, but I was going to write, like, yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to be honest, man. Like, the longer I play this, I think this is something I'm going to buy. Because the demo, very generous the way it is, and it's actually giving me a really good insight to the game. The developers are working on the game as we speak, which is nice comes out next year so it's not going to be rushed out and it's an easy go lucky game you don't have to mess around you're not pissing about trying to like do 400 million you know really horrible things it's a, it's a very easy ex exploration game where you just have to do all the basics to make things work and that's, that's good i like this you know it doesn't need a lot of explaining I mean, even on a tutorial basis, I don't even have to build a tutorial for this game because it, it does it for you. Everything is self-explanatory. It's there. It's so good. The only thing I haven't got is I, I'm not building my own food because, yeah, that's the one thing I didn't build. But I think, apart from the, uranium, uh, the Iridium place, I think I'm pretty much done. So I'm going back in there. We're gonna have a quick mooch around because I've got I've got yeah I've got oxygen on me, so I'm gonna go in there. I'm gonna have a mooch around the cave and see what's in there, apart from iridium, and then the next place is over the other side, and then and just start building stuff. I mean it's half past ten now. Could probably get away with another hour. This game you can build quite quick in this, so that might even be too long. All right, we're gonna go in here, bring up my crappy flashlight. And uh, have a mooch around. Cobalt. You know what? We run out of magnesium. We'll take this as well because we've basically run out of iron. I'm just going to. I think I'm going to fill my inventory up. Definitely need ice. So I think this is a playthrough game. I think this is a, hey guys, check out what we're going to do today is we're going to build my base uh, and then go from there basically. Today, we're going to go exploring the cave. Like I said, this is a big cave. You are playing, you... No, I'm, I'm playing the demo, the one that everybody can access on Steam. That's what it's, it says. It's a demo, so that's what I'm playing. The demo is very, very generous. I'm going to be completely honest. Really, really generous. There's a massive insight how this game's going to work.
So this is mainly just an iridium cave then. We'll take that because that's alley. But this is... I, I don't think I've ever played a demo game that's given me so much. Most of them are just like, hey, do this. And then all of a sudden, like four minutes later, the game's finished. There wasn't even a game on the... It was on the Xbox 360. I think it was a fighting game, and now I can't remember what it was called. But it literally gave you a minute to decide if you wanted to play the game or not. And that was it. A minute. A whole minute. And it was like, wow. Freaking pointless. Right, drop that. I'm taking this because I need this more than anything else. Um... You know what? I can find ice anywhere. And I can find iron pretty much anywhere. So I'm taking these out. We've got mushrooms. We've got aluminium. We're all good. I haven't touched the demo thing. I haven't touched it. I, I literally... I, I downloaded the, the demo thing that everybody else is playing. If this is limited, then it's limited. I, I haven't touched anything. Let me, let me just go back to the base and I'll, leave, I'll even bring it up on my screen. If if the, if beta is selected, it did it without me to, without me even being known. Yeah, demo is on Steam right now. It's what I'm playing. Cool, refreshing drink. Oh, yeah. Right. Maybe, but I haven't turned it on. That's what I'm getting at, is the fact that I, I haven't touched beta settings at all. I'm literally just playing how everyone else is playing if you just selected the game. So I don't know. Give me a sec. Um, where's my Windies? Right, let me just bring up Steam. Can we just go in chat screen? Oh no, um, that's epic. Don't need epic. The thing is, is that if I if I'm still playing this um, properties betas, so if I bring this down, bring the chat so this is that's the screen you can see. I'm not selected on a beta. I'm literally just playing the same game. That's the thing that's getting me is it's like, yeah. Oh, I've seen I, I've I've played demos that have done that before, but I've never seen a de I've never seen a demo play this long, and that's what I'm getting for is it's the it's the fact it's still going. Maybe updated. I didn't know about it. It's looking nice out here. Yeah? Right. Anyways. We need to start building better stuff. We need to start upgrading. We need to start going big. Even in my fridge, I've got to start, I need to buy. I need to start building growers to actually start building growing things. So we need to do some element runs. There's enough around here. Don't worry. But it's it's very weird. You know, it's like most demos I see are like quite limited. But this hasn't stopped for me. I know it has for other people.
That is cool. I'll just carry on. Um, no, not yet. So I think there may have been like an internal thing where it's just letting me play through. I don't know. All I know is I turned on the game. <laughs> Forgot my inventory is full. Block this up and we get iron, iron, iron. Ice is in the ice fridge. Magnesium. I think we should. Just, we need to build a magnesium thing because I'm. I need to pick up lots and lots of magnesium. Bloody iron. Is that how you spell magnesium? Probably not. What? It's only got one S. Alright. <laughs> that one. There you go. Magnesium. There. I'm, I'm not... I'm not a bright spark. Old Man Gaming. Welcome. So Old Man Gaming, he came in the other night and he was talking about this. So he might know more than I do. Let me just have a look, see what we've got in the progress log. I've, apart from this, this, this the seed separator, 250nk, and we're only up to k, so we have to go up to the next level, which is like lots more. So the seed spreader is how you go up for, so we're at 165k, when we need to be up to 250, so what we need to do is we need to build another one of those. And then that's just going to accelerate much, 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 much faster. So we should. Get another Iridium Road. Build that up. And then I need titanium, silicon and aluminium. Was that Magnus? So, titanium and silicon, so we need one of those, and we need one of those. And then we're going to build another one of these. It's just going to be mass heat. Now we need more power. <laughs> because it's t um, I'm basically at the limit now. Hey, like I said, I'm just playing the game. Fair enough. But I mean, the thing is, is I'm I, I'm just sitting here playing the game. I'm not really doing anything else. Yeah, eight months. Magnus, you're a legend. Thank you very much, though, matey. Right. So I need silicon, and then we're done. I need to build another uh, solar panel. There we go.
It's cranking up now. We got clouds. And we got rain in 30. Oh, it's going to rain. There you go. Right. Let me just bring this up and I'll show you what's running. So, main screen is what you can see. Me on Steam. The Planet Crafter demo. I'm not limited at 200. It's going up. I'm playing the demo. This is the one I'm playing. So I don't know. When we get to this 200k or 250, that's where that's when it's going to stop apparently. So I'll just wait. Hey, at the end of the day, this this demo has lasted me a bloody long time. So I'm alright with that. And apparently we got clouds, but I'm not seeing any. I've hit 649,000. That's what the KTI is. Look in the top right. 651,000 KTI. I've gone past TI. Yeah, that's why it's going to rain. Super Alloy. Right. So Super Alloy is one of everything. Magnesium. Right, so there's two Super Alloys. I don't think I've got enough iron to do that, so I need to find some more iron. Oh no, I'm going to run out of water. Okay then. But yeah, the de the, as I said, I mean, with the demo, I've just, I've just enjoyed it. I haven't really cared about what I'm doing. But, yeah, I mean... The demo was all good. I think the prologue is going to be it'll limit you because it's a prologue. So they're going to put that forward and then be happier. You know, and then it's the prologue's designed to get people to play it and people to play to a specific point. Play the demo, you know, I mean with especially with this one, you're actually getting a little bit more out of it, which is good. I like it. It's getting dark. Better take this before it gets underwater. Have you found the area? Yeah, I found the aluminium. <laughs> I went there this morning. That was a good little place. I enjoyed that. You have a cupboard full of water. Yeah, I'm, I, I should have done that myself, but... I was going to. I was going to pick up loads and loads of ice and just, like, make loads. But then I made a fridge. So that my fridge is where I steal my water and my food. Gonna be honest, I haven't really used it. So you know what? Let's just go back to full screen. I keep forgetting to go back. There we go. Full screen. Right. And I really should. This is my fridge. Stacked with food, oxygen, for seeds, water. It's all good. It's all good. We got some there. Right. So we did get some iron, so that's okay. Okay. 
Yeah, it's fine. At the end of the day, like if they're gonna st if they lock stuff behind the pay, it, like I wouldn't. I, I'm not gonna. I can't really call it a paywall, but you know what I mean. If they if they lock stuff behind it, then it's just people get intrigued about playing and wanted to play more. So, and it'll give people a bit more of a bite to go. Hey, you know what? I want to give this. I want to play this game. I'm gonna be honest. After playing for the amount of time I have, I want to buy the game. And I think it's I think it's right that they've done it the way they have because man, it's it's a, it's an addictive little game. I know what happened when you die. I haven't died yet. <laughs> so I oh yeah, I was doing that because I built yeah, right. So I want to build. What do I want to build? Why did I build? Why have I built three super alloys? That. Right. I need uranium bar. I need ice. Now we need to build a shed ton of water. Water bottle. No, I don't want to die. I've been this close where the screen started fading. I was like, nah, I don't, I don't you know, dying sucks. So I don't want to do it. So yeah, I haven't died in in the playthroughs. It's been it's been quite nice. Actually playing the game and not dying. Go figure. We run out. No. Right. I think this might blow up my like, thing. Maybe. Um It has to go outside. <laughs> there we go. A new level of confidence in power. There we go. I'm building another drill, right? I'm speeding this up. Okay, we're going big. When you've run out of air, O2, or water, you reset back to headquarters and there is no penalty. When you say headquarters, do you mean the place I built or the little space shuttle at the bottom of the hill? When's it going to rain? 57%. Not bad. Alright, so what do I need to build some more? I need to build these ones again. Magnesium. I need ice. We haven't got any ice. We built a lot of water. Uh, the drill basically is mining like bits to go into the atmosphere so that that's cool next i want to build i want to build this so we need three super alloys again three lots of titanium three lots of better so we just need to go and gather materials and build another three lots which isn't which is not difficult just gonna do it just gonna pick up everything we'll have a meteorite storm soon cannot wait Because the game knows when you start getting low on elements, you'll have a meteorite storm, and all of a sudden things will come back. I'm getting a bit low on iron down here, though. Say that, and the next thing I pick up is iron. Makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> I like bugs in games. Oh no, we've got full inventory. Right, back to the inventory. And fill it all back up. Come out and gather up a load, a load more. And then do the same a couple of times. Get loads of stuff. And just go for it.
It just makes sense that they're attached to something. Right, ice. Do we get ice? Yes, we did. We got ice. That is fine. Magnesium. Uh, titanium. Uh, silicon goes in here with aluminium. And then iron. Yay. Let's go again. Oh, actually. Need a drink. There we go. Done. Let's go. There's plenty up here. Greenhouse uh, B. Yeah, I know. I wanted it separate. It looks cool. I just thought it would look like, you know, it looks like I'm actually building a base. Little walkways here and there, doing this and there. I think, yeah, it's just the way it is. We do need iron and ice more than anything at the moment. So I want to go up in that corner because if it starts raining, I'm not going to be able to get across because it, you know, I haven't got any way of like jumping water. And there's a thing in the corner, so I might want to go and check that out soon. Or I just go, nah, screw it, and just go around the other side and go through the aluminium place again. And we we did empty that ship out there as well, so we did all right. Might just go for another explore around there, actually, saying that. Hmm. I guess it's out the house. <laughs> Quite literally. Cool. Cobalt. Definitely need some more cobalt. Silicone. Titanium. More ice. And then magnesium. There we go. So I think we've got enough to build few of them now I think we just need a bit more so I'm going for a run we're gonna go this way I'm gonna go into the aluminium place which in fairness does need a little bit of work so what you see is when you walk into this place it goes completely dark like this the, the sky goes from bright blue into like death black so, okay I think it might need a little bit of um, a little bit of work graphics wise it's not quite a hundred percent. Did we open that box? Hold on, let's go and check the box quick before I run off. Yeah, we've done it. Cool. Right. So as soon as you get into here. The deeper you go, and then it just goes black, and it's like that shouldn't make a difference. I did enter, I am that ship as well. It is a very shiny place. I haven't been out this far though. So this is all new for me. I haven't been out of here. So if there's anything over here, never been here. But you can really tell how big they want this game to be. When this is just the demo level and it's this big. So there's another ship over here. Oh yeah.
Hey, what is up, Panda? Yep, still transforming. Ooh, I got agility level one. Like, I don't need that. Cool. I suppose this would have been like low level. I'm going to assume that bit that I haven't been at comes up here. So if I go up here, I should go downhill. Yeah, so this leads down into the cavern that you start, uh, the area you start on. Yeah, so down there is where you start. So this whole passageway, you come up the other side. That's pretty cool. It's a shame we don't have a map, but you sort of, when you start walking around all these places, you start realizing where you've been a lot more. And the way that I explore things, it's like I'm just moving around and just differing mainly. Oh man. Okay, we're just going to ditch all the crap stuff. Don't need that. Need that more. Don't need that. Need that more. Don't need that. Need that more. And don't need that. Need that more. Everything else, I've got loads of it. We're getting out of here. I'm just about to run out of oxygen, so that's fine. Maybe. Oh, yeah. There we go. We've got the last thing that's hit it. We've got the seed spreader. Otherwise known as Ron Jeremy. Oh, yes. Right. But how big is this? This is much. See what I what I did with Valheim is I ran off the edge of the earth and just ran in a straight line. I'd love to find out where this goes. Yeah. Go for a run. We haven't done a run properly. And when I say a run, I want to aim for about there. We got enough oxygen. We might not. We've got half health, so we should be right. I want to see what's on the other side of the sand dunes now. I've got the ability. We're going for a jog. Oh yes. Trying to go further than any man before. But I'm going to assume this loops round. So this is the monolith in the middle. It loops round and goes back to the ship at the back. Yeah, this is what I do. I So I was... When I played Wasteland Trucker, I basically did what I thought was just best. Just to have a little mess around on. And, um, yeah, on Valheim, I, I, I walked all the way to the edge. And I was like, what's over there then? And I fell off. There you go. Look, there's the edge of the world. <laughs> as far as the eye can see. Right. Let's, let's boost up with oxygen. Now let's run back to my base, which is over there. And, um, yeah, I ran off and then just ran the planet. So I just ran across this plane, kept going. And then in the, when I made the video to it, people were just like, well, yeah, there's this other place. It's like, yeah, but this isn't where you think it is. This is if you go here. I, I literally ran past all of that. And there was all that. I found all the beta, almost like a, a basic beta area of uh, Valheim. And people were just like, oh, well, that's normal. It's like, well, it's not. Because 
There's nothing around. Oh, and we found a ship. Right in the middle. Oh, yes. So that's where we need to go next then. So how do we get in here then? So we're on the floor. Oh no, Valheim was massive. Like, I mean, it was it was ginormous. It's just I travelled to the edge. And then fell off the edge. And then kept running. Basically, I'd put on a mod on to, like, to sprint the map. So I sprinted it and just went for it. It was hilarious. So this is where we need to come next. We need to go to the ship in the middle. This will be my last exploration. It really will. But I think we I think we've got enough equipment now to get ourselves through. So I've basically ran the map now. All the main points at least. You just found that yourself. Yeah, just right in the middle. This is something I haven't picked up yet, and we need this. Right, we need to pick this box up first. Oh, you mean this game? I would say this is big. I mean, what? It's taken me... What, we're an hour and 32 into this one. We did two hours last night. We did near two hours today, so we've done four. We're going to be doing six hours worth of map running, and it's because I build quick. Like, it's like, I need to do this, 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 and then I'll get all that done. It's like, what do I do next? I'll carry on. And I'll get everything just done the way I need to do it as, as fast as possible. People could spend hours and hours and hours doing this and still not be maybe be as far as me. So that's pretty cool. <coughs> right. That can go in there. I think I've run... Oh, no, we've got one more space. No, we can do that one. We haven't got any ice. Got some silicon though. I think we have to build another box. I want to build more boxes. I need another box. Scroll! You know, I need a blob of iron. There we go. I might need another blob of iron after this. I'll build around all. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Right. That stuff goes up here. So that's good stuff. Uh, cobalt goes in this one here. That's fine. And all this extra stuff that I've been picking up will go in this spare box because I've got nowhere else to put it. Oh no, I'd say I, I would say for a demo, which is basically what this is, like six hours of gameplay without repeating myself, without going through loads and loads of like trials and tribulations. I would say this is a very solid demo. Very solid. And it does a lot as well it's not like it's half assed it's like they actually thought about putting extra and good stuff into this game and going you know what we just want to give the player a really good experience get to know the game really well and if you want it pick it up you know look into it go play the demo see what you think and i like it when a company gives a bit more out because it gives you a bit more of an understanding of where they want the game to go Instead of just, here, here's a demo. It's going to last you about an hour. Make up your mind. If I had to play this game for an hour and be like, oh, is that the end of the demo? I'd probably be thinking twice about it. It's like, well, do I really want it? I, I don't really know enough about it. I'll watch someone else's video. Guarantee it's going to be the same stuff that I've already done. But it gives me another insight from another perspective. Great demo. I, I wish more companies would do this. You know, I don't want to play another Call of Duty game or another Battlefield game that's like, hey, you get the full experience and is it? Yeah, but it's the same crap. With this sort of game, you never know what you're going to get until you play a, a longer version of it. Oh, oh, that's not fair. We'll take the aluminium, it's fine. Right, so I've picked that up. Now I need to go into that middle bit. Now I'm going to go into that ship. I'm going to empty the ship out and then we're going to... The only complaint I told them when I played it because I think they should be a tutorial on how to get started. No. No. No, 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 no. I genuinely, I think within... I know I've, I've played games like this before, but I'd say the learning curve is very easy. 
like compared, you know, compared to like Satisfactory or something, you know, Satisfactory seems simple, but I think for a newbie, that's really hard. Like straight up, but I think this is, you. It, most people could pick this up and play. Unless that's just me being optimistic. Right, back in a minute, guys. WNG Gamer! Welcome. Right, Titanium and Cobalt, I've got lots. I don't think, I haven't got anywhere else to put Aluminium and Silicon. I don't want to build another box. <laughs> right, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to get some iron. We have to build another locker. It's because I can't spell, don't I? That's silicon. There we go. Ah, right, okay, so we've got food, we've got water, we've got oxygen, we're going to that ship now, in the middle of those rocks. Actually, what's the what's the weather forecast look like? Right. Liquid water, 0 0.86, and rain. There we go. It's going to take a long time to get to that water. Plus side, we've got, we've got enough time to get to that ship. And then we can start bashing out the terraforming section. Yeah, you know, lots of power, lots of this, lots of that. Easier. <clears throat> Not sure where you get uranium from, though. Like, I mean, obviously, like, iridium's in there. But to build, a, uh, to build a reactor to get more power, there's nowhere I can farm uranium. Yeah? It's an odd one, that. Unless you guys know, uranium, where do you get it from? So we're basically sprinting at this point because we need to get in here like quick. Because it's so far in. Most of my fell from the sky. Fair enough. Oh yeah. 
<laughs> I'll take a hint for uranium, yeah? I'm going to assume it's in a mine. Yeah, I'll ask, where, where do I get uranium from? Ah, I'll be alright. Ah, okay, cool. Yep. This feels a little bit dodgy. Let me in! That's cool. So I need to build the launcher. It's fine. This is a nice clean ship. We don't need iron if we're getting this stuff. All right. Sorry, iron, 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 iron. We're taking the uranium, we're taking the flour. We're taking the food. I mean, we need fabric, so we'll take the fabric. Ah, okay. Well, iridium I can just get from the, um... Yeah, from, from the, uh, thingy. And this stuff's in a cave. It's not hard to find. And it's raining. It's raining! It's physically raining! Oh, yes. It's just awesome. Oh no. I want to take all of this with me. Right, I don't need aluminium. We'll take this more. Um, we need that. So we. <laughs> I'm like, hey, I need to use this. I'll use that as well. Um, we'll eat some food and we'll take a flower. I can't, I can't eat anything else. Right. <laughs> Just ditch all the crap and just leave that here. I don't care. It's raining. Which means things are going to start flooding. I've had this on my wish list for a while, definitely. Yeah, I mean... I, can't, I, I don't think... I, apart from a few little bugs and bits of pieces, which I, I expect from a demo version of a game anyway. But this is solid. Solid. Good experience, good fun. Enjoying it. Now I just need to get out, get back to base, start turning things around, and then just start really pushing into the evolution of the game. I need to build. I need to build the seed spreader as well. So I think that's gonna. Yeah, we need to start looking into that now. It shouldn't be too hard. I mean, we've got quite a lot of the, the materials for building a rocket pad, so we should have quite a lot of materials for doing everything else. Also, I've got quite a lot of material to actually start building, like, special ore as well. Oh, physical rain! This is so cool. Like, I think the other thing, the reason why it's so good is because you're actively seeing the changes you're doing to the planet, which is what humankind should be doing right now. <laughs> What, do we, what should we be doing? I don't know, looking after the planet, maybe? You know, it's only our life source.
We've got flowers galore. Right, we'll chuck that in there, chuck that in there. Right, put that in there. Put. We've got two of those special rockets now. Stick that in there, that's all good. And that goes in there as well. I didn't say drop you, did I? I said put you in there. Oh, we've got another fleece as well. Fleece, fabric, sorry, whatever. Weather. Iridium, we got iridium. And magnesium, we got lots of magnesium, it's fine. And then, we got a box full of seeds. And we got a box. See what I mean? I got loads of stuff. So, need to build another storage box, really. I, don't, I haven't got any iron. For now, it's all going in there. Until I come back. I know. Yeah, demo. Oh no! We done it again. Oh, I've got to stop doing that. That's getting really annoying. <laughs> right. Left with one bloody eggplant. Well, they don't go to the greenhouse, so you have to build another greenhouse. That's sort of where it gets a bit sticky. It's like, oh, do I really want to do that? So, yeah, basically, when you build it, you build it with a certain purpose. If you're only allowed to build, you can build more of these, obviously, but you know, or you could just build more of these. Because the biodome itself, you can only use. Where is the biodome? Up one. Come on, scroll up. You have to use the Lirum Lirma seeds, so they you can only use that certain plant to build a biodome. In order to build like these ones, then you have to build the plants we've got. So this one we've already built. And that comes with what's inside already. That's all good. So now. I need to start looking into going a bit harder into building big stuff. I think the next thing I need to buy Yeah. So you can build you can go in, right? But these are already programmed to be building the seed that you put them in with. The Lerma seed. There we go. Right. Now what was I going to build? There was something I needed to build and I can't remember what I was going to build now. And it involved... Oh, it was the seed separator. That's the one. So we need water. Three. Yes. Is that it? Magnesium aluminium. Is that the all I need? I'm going to assume I can only build this outside. Yeah. And it has to be within this range. A bit dirty in there. So I've got seeds. Now, when it says seeds, does it mean these seeds or these? Let's just try and see if we can do them all. There we go. <coughs> 
Now we just wait. There we go, see? These do a 500% extra. There we go, that, there we, and we're basically finished by this point. Amazing, isn't it? The miracles of growing stuff. <sighs> so those last like five and a half hours worth of gaming and five and a half hours of building stuff. And we're here. Building these now. Yeah, the ones in the pods are um these are actual oh i didn't put one in there oh my god okay we can have that one so all these are as, as like the highest level i could find so 500 percent uh that one's a hundred percent we could put one of those in there there you go There you go. The meteorite shower is a good thing. Trust me. So there we go. We got, we've got our first plant life. Yeah. Right now, we need to build a rocket ship. So we need to build this. So I need three super alloy, which we do have. But I need, I need to put all these back in as well. Um, I'll do this. And I'll just take those with me. Because that's the, they're what I need. Uh, we should have. One, two, three. Done. Um, titanium and iron. One, two, three. And iron. I don't think I've got any iron. I have. Just. Cool. Now we're going to build a rocket ship. So on my rocket ship, I'm probably going to have to build this over here. Oh, we're going to have to find some big ground on this, aren't we? Mwahahahaha! <laughs> Well, that's good. There you go. We built, we built flowers. Right. All right. Okay. So this is what I need to. So I think we need to do. Well, whichever one we need, we need rocket boosters and super alloys. So that should be like the first thing we need to look into building then. But this is pretty cool, you know. I built my little garden, got some flowers growing. Hardcore. There we go. Right, boosters. We need iridium and uranium and a super alloy. Defense platform. 
Am I am I being stupid? Um, I can't remember the ingredient we need to build a rocket with. Let's build a let's build a thing first, and then if I take some cobalt with me, take some silicon with me. I can't remember the other thing I need. I just want to blow a rocket up. That's all I want to do. I just want it to go up there and I just want it to blow up and I just want it to look cool. So what one do I need it to make? Hello. Right. Which one do I need? I need That's magnetic force, so we don't need that. Seed spreader. I think we need seed spreader. Oh, okay. Right, so we need super alloy. We need to build some super alloy and we need some speeds. And I think I've still got those seeds. I think I've still got three of them, maybe. That'd be cool if we have. I do need to build... Oh, I keep saying I need to build some lights. So we need three of these. This is what I'm going to build. I'm going to build these. Right, so we need... Iron. Ice. Silicon. I got silicon. Aluminium. Aluminium. Just in case I need those as well. And titanium. And some cobalt. There we go. And we'll take some magnesium as well. There we go. I didn't want to take all of that. There we go. So that should do it. And now we go over here and we build super alloy. Super alloy. So we've got two lots of super alloy. All good. Fridge. Uh, have a drink. Have some food. Yummy yummy in my tummy. Right, let's go. I want to build a rocket. I want to blow it up. And I want to... I know it's going to sound like a porn joke, but I want to spread my seeds. Don't forget, you can clip this stream and leave the clips in my, in my uh, thing. So now I'm going to build a rocket. That I can... Uh, that reminds me that this is... Here we go. In three, two, one, blast off, Mother Truck Dar. And away she goes. Now blow up and spread the seed of the plant's life and... Yeah. I'm going to watch it until it blows up. It's just a little dot. It's still there. It's still there. I can't see it anymore. Super alloy. Oh, wow. Okay, we'll go and find it. I'm waiting for the world to change now, man. It's on the ground like a... Oh, okay, cool. I'm going to go looking for it. We'll, we'll take some supplies with us. Right, so... Um, obviously, I'm going to have to build some more stuff when I come back, before I come back. Oh, I miss loads of stuff. I'd see that as just normal. Let's go hunting. Hunting. So that's the super part. Uranium. So uranium is going to come. To, if I start throwing rockets up into the atmosphere. And get some uranium landing. We'll be alright. So now that rocket's up in the sky. Am I going to start seeing plants like sprout up all over the place? That's sort of what I'm expecting now. Oh, cool, man. I mean, potentially what's going to happen is I'll probably be playing this tomorrow as well. <laughs> it's just because I, there's so much to it.
Well, I'll take a hint, but I don't know if I'll take it. I'm not really seeing much in the way of super stuff around the floor. Just titanium. Okay. Oh yeah, I'm there. Man, that's how blind I am. Like, I just ran over that. It was like sparkly rock. Cool. Gonna assume it's all up on this top ledge then. again here comes the rain again falling on my head like a memory falling on my head like a new emotion bum, bum. Ba -da 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 -bum. and it's things like that that get stuck in my head from my childhood and that can go around my brain for years. Years and years and years. Ah, it's cool, man. I think I figured that out now. Well, thanks to you guys. Oh, dude, I've built two bases in the same time. <laughs> I think I'm full. No, but I just can't pick that one up. Alright, cool. If that's how you're gonna be, it's fine. Oh yeah, there's a chest up here as well. Cool. Oh yes, that's what we like. Oh right, okay, we'll get rid of uh cobalt, because in fairness, cobalt's easy to find. Oh yes. Parkour, do you want more? I think we're full, aren't we? Right, we, well, we got one. More, we can get one more piece. There's one more piece. For bonus points, can you tell us the artist who sang that song? Oh no, I'm around the other side. Hold on. And uh, okay, I was gonna say I'm discombobulated, but no, I know where I am. Don't worry. all good in the hood though it's all good right we'll pop back and we'll start looking into all this other stuff but i'm going to assume if i just go up into the mountains on the cliffs and stuff that's where i'm going to find super alloys so that's fine just means i know where i'm going i'm just looking around now i just need to start pushing Fair enough. A room that's um, iron and titanium. I was like the fact I got flowers. So if I take this off now, are these flowers staying here? Like I don't have to. I don't have to keep these water. I can just move this seed spreader to another place. Or have you guys not done that yet? But I do tend to move, I do tend to build like real quick.
take those out and put that in. Titanium. It's aluminium. Magnesium. And the other reason why I build fast is because I've got kids. So you have to do stuff before things get destroyed. It's fun. Alright, so I need cobalt and ice. Not trying it. Okay, cool. Guess what we're going to do. Let's give this a bundle, shall we? If I move this... Cannot do it. Interesting. Ah, oh, it's because it's got flour. So, no. Oh, yeah, it does. As soon as you take that seed out, that's it. Got it. See, there you go. Now, you know, for instance, you have to keep that there. There we go. You only ever know until you know. Cool. We know now. Oh, it's the Rhythmics. So we're at liquid water at 26%. We're blitzing this thing now. Oh, look at this. Pressure's going up. We're getting there. Heat. We need to upgrade on heat a bit more, I suppose. We need some more iridium. That's fine. No, I think it makes sense in, in some small sort of way. <coughs> I get why you think it's dumb, though. <laughs> but it's just grown. Yeah, well, as soon as you take the seed away, everything stops. That makes no sense. So we're at a 3 million terra terra yeah, terraformation index. 3.5 million. We're doing really well now. So here, where I'm standing, in whenever it starts like settling water, this is where it's going to start settling. So I want to get down there quick. Because when the water comes properly. Yeah, this is going to be interesting. I think tomorrow, I want to play this tomorrow as well. I think, well, tomorrow evening when I, when I normally stream. Because I think and I think another four hours will be like, yeah, we're good. But yeah, I do tend to, I, the reason why I tend to rush is because I don't often get a lot of time. And so not having a lot of time makes me think a little bit quicker when it comes, when it comes to playing games, I'm really fast. Doing anything else, I'm like really slow. I just don't care. I just go, oh, whatever. We need to build a water fridge. It's just... It's just something I need. I haven't got any iron to build a fridge. <laughs> I need iron. <laughs> I need to build another fridge. I need a water fridge. <coughs> Sucks. There's iron. That's titanium. I don't need titanium. I need iron. Oh, we're done. Actually, looks like a base though. That's the thing. You know, we got a rocket ship lab. We got our little biodome. We've got this. We could build loads and loads of little biodomes though. So we could start making a massive imprint. It's the evolution of a base, man. This is cool.
water. That's what I need. Did you look in the cave for uranium? Sometimes it's around the corner, you know. Oh, the, the one that's in, the one that's near me is iridium, isn't it? Unless I'm missing it. But I didn't see anything green in there. Unless you're on about a different cave. I don't know. Are we talking about the same cave? So when it says liquid water, it's like, but isn't water liquid? Or are we just talking about a mist? Is that what I've been creating? Actually, you know, I'm going to put my water by this one down here, the front door, right next to the fridge. I'm going to put the water next to the bottom. So this is going to be water. Right. Okay. And then I'm going to turn this one into iron. And then we can put our iron in that one and be good. So the cave, what this ca that cave over there, that one, raining again. <laughs> we need to start a series with wasteland trucker and or motorcycle mechanic. I love you. Okay, so. Um, when it comes to Wasteland Trucker, <coughs> I was going to wait until the updates start really flowing into that game to make that game better in order to do anything. And Motorcycle Mechanic, I did a couple of episodes and it was like, f the game for me wasn't pulling me in as much as it does with like Car Mechanic Simulator. So I stopped playing it. I know it's just, that's just me, but that was literally how it was for me. I was like, I don't really want to play this anymore. And I like the game, but there's just not enough variety in it to keep me going. If that makes sense, then it's all good. But for me, I was just, I was just like, you know, I don't really, I, I can't bring myself to keep playing it. And it's really hard because I really wanted it to be a good game. I just can't do it. But Wasteland Tracker, um, yeah. So that cave has got um, iridium. I didn't see any uranium in there because uranium glows green and in there is just red. <clears throat> so I do apologize for motorcycle mechanic. I just really, I mean, after I did the bit, after I, I went through that game so quick and what, within a few hours, I'd already, but I've already got enough money to build. I bought the biggest warehouse, bought that. And I was like, now what? There's nothing really in there to make me go, hey, I really want to play this game some more. Like a CMS, there's more cars variety. There's more stuff you can do with it. But motorcycle mechanic, there's like seven versions of the a bike, and it's, that's it. And that was it. And I was like, this is slightly disappointing. Yeah, I don't think I've ever found in a. I haven't found a re, um, uranium in here. But there's always the red stuff. Iridium's in here. The so Wasteland Trucker is a different one. Um, yeah, uh, that was really mixed. So, I when I did those, like the the whole, like putting a little like story together inside that inside CMS and actually being able to like have a little thing going in the side. That e that people actually either enjoyed it, like you know they enjoyed the fact that there was an actual story inside this instead of just the same old boring crappy gameplay that everyone else puts out, 
And then there were other people just going, oh my God, I really don't want to watch this because, you know, all I want to do is watch a car being built. It's like, well, you are, but, you know, you're getting a bit of entertainment. Well, that sort of puts me off a bit. It's like, but why? It makes the content better, if you know what I mean. So I really just stopped ignore. I, I, I started to ignore those people and just carried it on because for me, in order to make a, a, you know, being a mechanic in a game isn't the most enthralling thing to be ever done. I mean, if you're a mechanic in real life, it looks a little bit more fun. You know, you get to actually do things hands-on. But when you're just playing a game and it's like, oh, right, okay, cool. You sort of want something else to push it a bit. And then you can't. So making that story and that in that thing, was, for me, was just making that game better for me. And I think I might, oh, I, I don't know, I might die. Maybe. We might see. Yeah, I mean the as yeah as old man said, I think maybe that uranium being in that cave might be part of the update. Oh yeah, no, that's what I do. At the end of the day, I I I, I build stuff the way I want to make a, a video, so that's why I do several different types of videos. So I do like having the fun and doing a let's play and whatever. Then I'll do tutorial content to actually like help people, and then I'm all good. See, I can't see how you died, man. This is so easy to get back here. <laughs> Sorry, no, it is a pain in the ass, actually, in fairness. Right, I mean, we've got a couple of rods already, so we, we, you know, I've got, I've got uranium rods. I could build another power supply. I went to my base. I just built where, then went outside, and then all of a sudden the planet is all yeah, yeah. It's I think that's like a heat wave. Oh yeah, so um, flipper mechanic is definitely one I want to get into, if whenever it comes out. And the reason why is because it's arcade machines, and like pinball machines and stuff. So that was the main reason why I wanted that one because it's just that's right up my street. Okay, so we need super alloy, water bottles, and uranium. Well, so we need three of these. And would you believe it? I I just built like all of those water bottles. Oh, that I did find some on there. Yeah, but have you got the um, thing image you get the um, the update uh, the the beta installed? Because I don't, and it might just be that. If it is that, then so be it. Now we are properly powered. Right. Build the rocket and rain down. I think I think I need to build another rocket, don't I? What do I need for a booster? Iridium. Right, okay, cool. We can build an iridium rod. We got enough. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Awesome. And some uranium. No, it was. It, 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 I've had that on my wish list for about two years. Well, I did let it. I let this. I want to know what happened to my rocket. Then the seed separator. Magnetic fat. Is that the one I need to do? Attracts iridium asteroids. Gives a global generation bonus by protecting the magnetic field. Okay, so I need silicon. Right. Wow. I ain't got any silicon on me. You know what? Whilst I'm in here, have we got another booster? Um... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, cool. I want to launch two.
I've got an idea. Don't worry. I'm just. I'm going to launch a couple of rockets into the sky, and we'll see the. We'll see this tomorrow. Basically, I'm going to throw another plant one up there, and I'm going to throw some iridium up there as well. See what happens. So yeah, I've probably got about ten. Actually, well, no, it's quarter to twelve. So, got fifteen minutes. Let's do this quick, then, shall we? So we need. To, oh, I need another super. Oh my god! I need more super alloys. Here we go. I'm just gonna take it all with me. It's great. Right, we need water. Water in my joker. Done. Fantastic. You never really run out of food too much in this game, do you? Like food, not a lot. Water, every five minutes. I need a drink. I need a drink. Sounds like my kids. Daddy, 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 I need a drink. Daddy, drink. Daddy, just gonna cat, just gonna go for it. And boom. No object. There's a fucking great big rocket there, you twat. Go on, off you go. Have you finished spawning? Off you go. Follow your friend. There we go. Bye bye. Right, so we're going to have two massive explosions now. We're going to have lots of iridium and uranium. And then we're going to have some more seeds up there. Should be fun. Whoa, those come in a bit faster, don't they? Incoming! Oh crap, that one's coming right for me. Let hell bring down in a wrath of fire. Whoa, that was close. Whoa, there we go. Have some of that. Your base is red now. <laughs> Go and have a look, shall we? Yeah, there's like phases, like the yellow me I'm not sure what yellow means and then oh, wow, look at all the mess. Next time I'll bring the uranium one down. Iridium's good. These giant boulders disappear at any point because this is slightly annoying. So I'm going to assume in order to do like the irid uh, the uranium one, you need uranium bra or uranium stuff. 
Let's go and have a look quick. Yeah, okay, so that's Cobalt. We could do that. No fear. Right, so we need Cobalt. And a booster. Right, cool. What's the worst going to happen? Nothing. Oh, I picked up two. Build one of those. Build one of those. And then we need um, cobalt. We're all good. Right. Right, let's go and blow up another rocket. 8.5 million terraforming index. Oh, I need three bits of cobalt. There's, there's a bit of cobalt right there. Right in front of me. There you go. <laughs> Blow up another one. These rocks stay around for bloody ages, I don't know. Say that, and they will start disappearing now. I was going to land a little bit close. No, you can't get in there. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's almost impossible. It's like you can't really get in there until all of it's disappeared. I think I'm pretty... Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with our progression we've done today. Hopefully all this stuff sticks around. Need water. Yep. Anyways, where's all uh, Yeah. So this is gonna be for uranium. I'm just gonna take this out and this out and this out. And then we're just gonna score that uranium. Cool. And then I mean, we still. I, I suppose we could put a second penis rocket on the table, couldn't we? There, we've got two penis rockets. Jeff Bezos would be very proud of us right now.
So that's the I've seen this come up a couple of times. What's VOT? I don't know what you're on about. VOT, FYI. I don't know. Just going to stand up here and look over my kingdom. Uh, right, on that note, we're pretty much done for today. Guys, if you want to watch more of this and you come and have a chat tomorrow, a couple hours worth of live stream, we're going to see how far we can take this game until it sort of goes, nah, you can't play anymore. So thank you very much for kicking by. This has been Hybrid Steel. If you have enjoyed this, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and notification button below for all other updates. I'll be back here with a brand new li live stream video or whatever else I do on this channel. Until then, I want to say thank you very much for kicking by. Have a great night, morning, afternoon, or wherever you're from. I'll see you all later. I want to say peace out. Have fun. Enjoy everything you guys do. Boom. Fist bump to you. Thank you.